Hello, everybody. Hello, hello, hello. If you are interested in making a premium Gwent card, then I'm going to try to do that for you right now as quickly as possible. So just follow these steps and you should be able to do it pretty easily. So here's one that I've made already, which is Golden Necker. Uh, we're going to work with Blue Boy Lugos today. And so um, I'm going to actually try to put Trinet's face on it with using this picture right here. So before you do this, make sure that you have um, the person's picture that you're going to use as permission. Uh, yeah, that's fine, Ocean Love. Or if you're just doing original art, that's fine. Make sure that you're not trying to make money off of it. Make sure you keep the SRB, so no gore, no nudity. And make sure that you don't pretend like CDPAR endorses it. So what you're going to have to do is make sure um, you go to this website. I'm going to show my screen so it's even easier for us. Here's Blue Boy Lugos. You go to card database. Type in your card. I'm going to put this link in the description. And then Blue Boy Lugos is right here. You click on it. You go click on illustration. You right click on anything and you click on this. What you need is you actually need this number up here. This is the only thing you care about. So 1240. So you then go to this file right here. We're in Uber, so make sure you have 4K um, graphics installed. It's free as well. And then you take the file. Ours is going to be 1240, 1240. So you just go down here to 1240, you save it. And then you, I made a couple folders, an original and a copy, just so I don't get in trouble because you don't want to save over your original copy just because you might want to put it back uh, later. So here's the file right here, 1240. So we're going to use the original. Let's go over to our extractor, which we talked about before. Uh, it's in the description below. Go to open. We're going to go to Uber, tutorial, original, open. Unpack it, yes. And then save it as anything. I'm going to save it as just Z1. It doesn't matter. You're not going to ever use it again. Uh, right here where it says texture, click on this, make it blue. Go to plugins. Go to export to PNG. And so what we're doing right now is tutorial, original, just save it. And right here, here's the file. And so this is what a premium file looks like. You might say, oh my God, I had no idea a premium card looks like this. I thought it would just be a gift. No, it's it's like totally dissected. So we're just going to mess with this dude's face, whoever that is. I guess it's Blue Boy. Uh, so what you do is you go to GIMP right here. You click on open. I have all these files, but it doesn't matter. Just drag the file in here and it automatically goes to it. Go to open. And so now we need to put Trinet's face on this. So I've already done that. <laughs> uh, just go to tutorial, open, and here's Trinet. Ah, look at that. So it's not perfect, but you got to get the shape right. Because um, if you don't get the shape right, then you can see the parts are really close together. So you'll bleed into another part and it won't look good. And you can imagine changing background, backgrounds are easier than anything else. So we have Trinet's face. So all we're going to do now is you go to the Unity Extractor again. You go to Plugins. You go to Edit. And then you don't care about any of this. Just go to Load. And then in Tutorial... I would have to save it, but it, it doesn't it doesn't matter. I'm gonna go to the actual file where, where trying it says, but whenever you create the file, you'll you'll create another save file. Or you can just save it as the original. So there we go. That's where the Trinet picture is. You click on OK, and then you click on slow multi-thread. And then you don't even have to click OK, it's just saving right here. Then you go to file save, OK, and then you go to file save. Uh you don't want to save it as the original. So you just want to go to copy and save it as the copy. So now we have our official copy of Trinet. So then you go to tutorial copy and then you copy this. I just hit control C and then you go here where the main file is replace this file and there you go. There's trying it. So if you want to make a card like this, Push him. Using someone's Push face, him. you can see how easy it is. Push him. It's even easier on standard because in standard you have a regular picture. If you want to change this part right here, the actual picture, then just go to um, high instead of Uber, which is one step before, and then just do the exact same thing. You just change the file and you change the picture and it'll actually change the card. But in game, this will show up. <laughs> so if you want to see more stuff like this, if you want to see stuff like uh, Disco Vilgaforce, then you can head on into my Discord. I make cards like this all the time. If you guys have cards that you want me to play with, I'll actually play with your cards, your custom cards. Then just put it in Discord and I'll take a look at it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think, and I'll see you next time.